गुड मॉर्निंग किड्स दिस इज जॉयदीप रक्षित योर डिजाइन थिंकिंग कोच लेट्स गेट इन टू दी अदर एस्पेक्ट ऑफ दी एम्पैथी प्रोसेस एम्पैथी मैप सो वी विल बी लर्निंग अबाउट दी एम्पैथी मैप सो वट इज एन एम्पैथी मैप एन एम एम्पैथी मैप इज ए कोलाबरेटिव विजुअलाइजेशन टूल यूज टू आर्टिकुलेट वॉट वी नो अबाउट ए पर्टिकुलर टाइप ऑफ यूजर ओके सो वी आर अंडरस्टैंडिंग द यूजर at this press process we understand more about the user so what we are trying to uh, uh, understand about the user is what the user says what the user thinks what the user does and how the user feels we need to understand all these aspects about a user before even getting into the ideation process so our objective is to know as much about the user to really understand what is the problem that we are going to define in the defined phase traditional empathy maps are split into four quadrants thinks says thinks does and feels with the user or the persona in the middle so this is the user or the persona about whom we want to know what they say what they think what they does and what they feel <coughs> an example i am looking for some new type of story line the user is saying i want some loose ends in the story and expect a sequel so uh, user is trying to find a loose end in the story is saying and they want to open up a new sequel opportunity what they does i start reading from a few pages back to catch up the exactly where i left off so this is what they does i think the author can use more plots more plot twists i think the story need to always have a happy ending so this is what the user is thinking about a particular story i feel the story should make me think and leave some space for the reader to draw conclusion so here the user is actually feeling they are expressing their feelings so this is how we actually record what a user says thinks does and feels what is the approach for a empathy map being prepared with the right question with other interview tools and techniques are key to successful conduct of a deep user interview so here what we are doing a uh, we are conducting a deep user interview by doing this deep user interview we are able to understand more deeper about the user whose problem we are trying to solve or the audience for whom we are trying to solve a problem prepare your deep user interview by carrying out the following activities <coughs> prepare your interview questions be prepared with the right questions to explore the deep user needs with the use of open ended probing questions use empathy map or a journey map to generate the right questions use empathy map help to generate questions related to think feel see say and do hear pain and gain so these are the few things which we is the outcome of the empathy map so this is how you create the empathy map so here is the middle is the user who is your persona okay what they think and feel what they see what they hear what they do and say what is their pain what is their gain all those things are coming in the one map this is the empathy map so the questions are what does the user think and feel what is really important to the user what drives the user what worries the user what are the user aspirations so here we understand about the think and feel of the user then here what does your user hear from others what do friends and family say who influence the user and how what communication channels are influential this is a very 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 interesting tool which can be which actually helps you record much deeper about a particular user and if at the moment we use this particular tool we will be learning everything about that particular user and our product will be more depth have a more depth and cover of the actual pain points of the user what does the user see what does it look like who surrounds the user who are the user user friends what makes the user happy what problems does the user encounter who are the people associated with your user who are the decision makers 
are the uh, is your user influenced by other people's uh, decision do and say what does the user say do what is the user attitude what could be the user be telling to others are there any conflicts between what users say and do and truly think and feel <coughs> pain what barrier and challenges does the user face what are the user frustrations what are the obstacles what makes user feel indifferent what are their pain points gain what makes user happy or satisfied so you have to take the user from one state to another state the state of being in pain to the state of being in gain so you need to understand the pain and the gain what does the user truly want how does the user measure value what gives you user passion and motivation so these are the tool empathy tool which can be used in the empathy process to understand in depth about the user and collect lot of information this information can become insight for us when you move ahead and understand the problem of a particular user because once you have captured all these points from here you will get a detailed analysis of understanding the problem of a user a very small example you want to buy a tv or your parents want to buy a tv how they feel so for example the user is jammy or any name for that matter on the person who is going to buy the t tv what they say in this quadrant what they think what they does what they feel so what jem is saying i was expecting something different what do you think where should i start what brand do i look what size of is best i want something reliable so these are the things which jem is thinking so all the answers has to come out what else am i missing wasting too much time i want something awesome why is this so hard do they think i am stupid what is the best for me too many acronyms maybe this isn't the best so the user is now thinking before getting into a decision of buying a tv what does they do check the website make small decision postpone big decisions observes in store more research list pro pros and cons compare products ask friends so this is what the user jemi who does what they are doing when they are in a thinking process to or in a decision process to buy a tv feels overwhelmed fear inadequate excited unsure who to trust and shares so this is a very simple illustration of the empathy map this map can be used to understand very deep about your user this is about the empathy map thank you kids